Hello everyone, my name is Shirley Garcia and I'm 22 years old. Um, I'm here representing Spirit Awakening. I'm a peer mentor for them. Um, I bring this up because I just wanted to say um, being um, growing up, being incarcerated and in the schools, I came across many organizations. And there is very few organizations that can actually reach out to the children and make a change because of the circumstances we are going through at the time. And I just wanted to say that if you are here representing an organization, please don't stop because you are the moving force and you are molding us into better citizens and better people. So um, I just wanted to say that. Um, and I'm going to be um, reading a piece called Orange Jumpsuit. When I left institution, it took me a long time to actually feel free once again. When I stepped out of those gates, I no longer knew who I was. I was still imprisoned in my mind. I was replaying my past for a long time, feeling sorry for myself and afraid to take on life again. My mind was trapped. Was I that girl in an orange jumpsuit? and chains wrapped around my ankles, waist, and wrists? Or was I that girl who had dreams, goals, and love in her heart? Or was I now just a product of society, just another number, just another statistic, just another failure? A person who can no longer feel emotion, regret, or compassion? What would now define me? They say we are cold and don't calculate our moves correctly, but we know survival. And there is no rules. It is a way of life. Is it a way, it's a way to maintain. It's just another day. How do we explain this to them who have never gone one night to sleep hungry, who've never seen their own people suffer, who've never made a heartless decision a day in their perfect lives, who've never long lost friends and no longer feel pain or are surprised? Our hearts beat no more. Our, our hearts feel no more love, and our veins are full of hate. We are searching for that day where we can break away and be human once again. Every day I wake up and I look at myself in the mirror and I make a choice to be better. I choose to move forward and I choose to leave it all behind. And I walk away, I choose to be free. I am a master of self-control because I was able to be chained down yet every second was eating away at me and I made it. I chose to be free, I know it can be. Thank you.